Previously on Paper Mario, Artie made a mistake and actually accidentally. Yep, that's the word. He accidentally upgraded his BP three times in a row. Well, actually, kind of accidentally. The first time was accidental, but the second time I just kind of rolled with it because I've got the HP and FP up plus badges, so I could just do with them whatever I want. Also, I don't think it... I'm preparing for the boss now, so let's see. <sighs> I'm not gonna need money, money, or payoff for this badge. Technically, I won't need speed. No, I'm still gonna want speedy spin though. I could use Zap Tap, but honestly, <gasps> I'd rather have some other stuff on. For starters, Power Jump, Power Bounce, Dodge Master. Oh, look, that eats up most of my AP, uh, badge power. I can't believe I don't have Jump Charge yet. I could do a Sleep Stomp, could do a Shrink Stomp. Eh, I'm not going to be using those, let's be honest. Okay, looks like I'll do first attack. Oh boy. He's coming. Hmm, I might be in trouble. That star spirit ran away, and now I think someone suspicious is in the castle. I sure don't want to make King Bowser mad. He's scary. He did make me invincible, but if I screw up, he might change me back to normal. Interesting. Time for some beauty rest! Oh, looks like all Quabba's Tubba Bubba creatures like their sleep. Well, we gotta open this chest. Hi there, I'm Yaki, a faithful and chatty follower of Master Tubba Blubba. His very important, or my very important job is to guard his valuables. But, you don't look like Master Tubba Blubba at all. That means, you've come here to steal me, the magical key that unlocks the door to Windy Mill at the foot of Gusty Gulch? And furthermore, your goal is to find out if there's a secret inside that Windy Mill? Uh, sure. You're a very honest person, aren't you? Master Tubba Blubba, a thief! Good humph, what's all the noise? Five more minutes, Mom. Oh no, he's awake, we have to run! Also, this music is amazing. This whole part is super epic, actually. Hey you, thief! Stop! Oh, how can you not love that part? This is where Speedy Spin really helps. Well, I mean, he's easy to outrun anyways, but... I wonder if he has a rubber band AI. <laughs> if he does catch up to you, just run away from the battle. Also, there are no guards here. That's good. And thanks for making uh, co collapsing parts of your like castle all on your guards. That was great. At last, we've arrived at Tubble Blubba's castle. Are you ready, everyone? Be brave. We must do all we can to help the Lady Bow. But what can we do? This is no time to lose our nerve, fellow boos. Our dear lady is fighting against Tubba Blubba himself. We mustn't hesitate. Come back here! What's that noise? Tubba Bob is chasing you and he's right on the other side of the door? What? You might be able to find out Tubba Bubba's weak point? Oh, of course, the windmill at the foot of the hill. You must hurry, run as fast as you can to the windy mill. We'll hold Tubba Bubba here. It's too dangerous. He's a madman. He'll eat every last one of you. Ugh, why won't this door open? I don't know how long we can keep holding this. 
Don't worry about us. Go, for all our sakes. Don't look back. Well, now we gotta go to the windmill. I smell delicious ghosts. Open the door. Alright. Here's another place where I say avoid all the enemies. Mainly because this scene is, like, too epic to stop and fight enemies. This Solomon alone is, like, one of the most amazing pieces of music written for the game. Mystical key? Let's go in. We're gonna want Goombario. I did not want to fight you. If it's just you, though. Looks like my first attacks isn't strong enough to kill these guys instantly. Oh, they still give me one star point, that's why. For enemies that give you no star points, you can... Well, I mean, I mean might as well, I guess. No entry allowed. Really? No entry allowed? Absolutely no entry allowed! Who are you? What? Mario? Did someone tell you that I'm the secret strength of Tubba Blubba? Someone spilled the beans that the Tubba Blubba in the castle's just a shell and I'm controlling it from here? You can't trust anybody. I can't let you out of here knowing the secret of my invincible body. Sorry, but here we go. Also, this is some of my favorite music in the game. This is Tubba's heart. You might say it's the heart of Tubba's secret. HA! Okay, that wasn't funny. Max HP 50, attack power 6, defense power 0. He has a terrible attack, so hide when he tells you he's about to unleash it. This attack will take away 12 HP. Whoa! Try to beat him before he can do this huge attack again. Trust me, it's dangerous. This is Bo's turn to shine. Seriously, this music is just like one of the most fantastic pieces of music ever composed. Hey, you, Lady Ghost, you look quite tasty. Stick around after the battle. Fighting makes me hungry. Blech! You wish. You don't have a chance, you ghost goblin freak. Mario, now I'm really mad. Let's beat this fiend up. <laughs> I'm gonna do this great attack. It's impossible to avoid. I just have to prepare a bit, so hang on for a second. Well. I'll show off out of sight now. Because trust me, you don't want to get take 12 damage. Let's power bounce. Dodge Master sure does help. Yeah, you'll notice Bo did not get a turn. That is because she used out of sight last turn. So if he keeps doing this charge move, as long as you've got the FP, he's actually really easy. Oh, well, th thank you for this. I wasn't going to take damage anyways. I like it when he just does his charge move versus his actual attack. This. That deals 6 damage, and that's actually a pretty big amount by itself. But this means Bo gets to attack. Alright, Bo. Don't hold back! Hmm. 
I probably should have shown off what... Actually, he might have... No, he wouldn't have killed me, but... There's another fight after this one, basically. Spoiler alert. Seriously, this music is so good! Alright, now he's got low enough HP. Owie! Ow, I'm hurting! I have to get out of here! I like how the heart has a mask on as well. Get out Gumbario again. If you're going for all the tattles, that is. Otherwise, keep Bow out. Boy, here he is. It's time to reunite! I don't think the heart works like that. Oh yeah, now I'm feeling good. With my heart and body united, there's no way to beat me! This is Tumble Bulba, now reunited with his heart. This is finally his true self. Max HP 10, attack power 4, defense power 0. Probably. His hip attack causes six points worth of damage. Be careful, because I'm not exactly sure what his other attacks can do. But I think he's definitely weaker than before. <laughs> I love his damage move. So that's his weaker attack. He can also jump on you. Goodbye, Tubble Bubba. You are really easy. Yow! Oh, why couldn't I have got double star points there? <laughs> oh, 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 no! With my heart and body united, I'm not invincible anymore. No, I'm back to not invincible, Tubba Blubba. That's so lame. I give up. Look, I'll give back all the ghosts I ate. Forgive me. Well, that was sporting of him. I'm actually a really sensitive guy trapped in a huge body. I don't want to be invincible anymore if it means I have to fight guys like you. Aw, oh, poor guy. <laughs> Serves you right, and everyone who got eaten has returned safely. Hooray! But I guess I'd better tell everyone not to scare old Tubba Blubba anymore. He used to love scare- we used to love scaring Tubba Blubba night and day because he was such a coward. Oh well, we're not sorry for it. Scaring folks is what ghosts do, so boo on him. Ha! Eh, that puts him in a much more sympathetic light than you, though. Besides, that was a pretty invigorating experience. I've never felt so full of excitement before. And, ahem, <clears throat> it was also a good learning experience. I think I'd better experience some more of the outside world. So, I think I'll accompany you a little longer. Is that okay, Mario? Of course it's okay, right? No. You don't have to be polite. <laughs> you won't have to worry about any feet anymore as long as I'm with you. <laughs> Here you go, Mario. I'm giving you back the Star Spirit as I promised. Bootler, snap to it. Come over here. I think I'm giving Bo a different voice every time as well. Here, Mario. He's free now. It was inside Bootler's handkerchief the whole time. This is probably my favorite Star Spirit. At least in terms of the power he gives you. It's really good. Especially for this upcoming world. Da 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 End of chapter! After solving the secret of the invincible Tubba Bubba, Mario and party set free the star spirit Scholar. Now, with Tubba Bubba just a bad dream, the boos are free to haunt to their heart's content. Even the lonely wind echoing through Gusty Gulch seems to be celebrating the victory. At least for now. With the newest party member Bo in tow, Mario and the friends are ready to take on their next challenge. Oh yeah, this is a really short Peach part, unfortunately. So I can't give Mario the power rush this time. 
I wonder how Mario's doing. Do you think he found a way to beat that tub of blah blah? I wonder too. I'm so worried. What if Mario got hurt? Well, um, no use wondering. Why don't we go out and try to eavesdrop again? If Mario managed to beat tub of blah blah by now, Bowser and his followers will be really, really mad, don't you think? You may be right, Twink. There's no use just sitting around worrying like this. Let's see what we can find out. Also, this is, I think, the last time this music plays when you're Peach. Oh boy. It can't be! No, no, no! Explain that again, slowly! Your wretchedness, I keep trying to tell you. Tabba Bella was... defeated by Mario. Well, that's strange, because you told me he was invincible! How can you beat someone who's invincible? Grr, stupid Mario. I guess maybe he found out the secret that made Tabba Bella not quite so invincible. And then he beat him! Ah, I despise Mario! Really? Your filthiness. We have to come up with another tactic, and quickly. Mario will most likely go to Shy Guy's toy box next. Yes, so we should prepare something there for his arrival. I won't be satisfied just having him beaten up anymore. What we need to do is find his weak point and completely humiliate him! Yeah! Kami Koopa, you've got to find out what Mario hates and... Huh? Gah! For the love of why? Why is Princess Peach here? What is wrong with those guards? No, wait, hang on. This is actually good timing, you my mischievous princess. We're just discussing the weak points of our mutual friend, Mario. So, Princess Peach, what do you know about his weaknesses, huh? And listen, you must be honest, which one of these things does Mario hate the most? So <laughs> this is kind of interesting. <laughs> you get to choose whichever you say, it doesn't matter what you say, he'll put it in the toy box for Mario. So, as much as like, well, Mushroom would be useful, I'm gonna say Goomba, it's the best. <laughs> hmm, I see, excellent! Is there another thing that fills him with dread? Okay, so Hammer Bros are actually like fairly tough enemies that are, aren't until like the end of the game. But I'd rather have a Thunder Rage. Good, good! And how about these fiends? Which of these fiends does he hate? And then, okay, Koopa Trolls are also super tough enemies, but they'll give you a lot of star points at this point in the game, but I'd like, I'd like to save that for the end, so let's do Super Soda. Oh, excellent! Perfect! Thanks, Princess! <laughs> Be sure Mario can't avoid these fiends that he hates! We'll beat him for sure! Did you get all that, Kami Koopa? Get going immediately! I'm not sure that we can entirely trust what the princess tells us about Mario's weak points, but I'll do as you say. Of course you will! My tactics are brilliant! They're pure art! So, Kami Koopa, have Princess Peach taken back to her room immediately! Finally, we will witness the end of Mario at last! <laughs> Guards, attention! Take Princess Peach back to her room at once! Yes, ma'am! No, not again! There's gotta be a better way to do that. They just like pick her up and carry her off. That's kinda weird. Twink gets to stay hidden for a lot of this as well. What voice did I give this guy? Hello again, Mario. I knew you could do it. I don't know how to thank you. I knew it was the right decision to ask you to help us. You're a great man. Now that I'm free, I can help you. Ha! Mario's star energy goes up to free. Mario can now use Star Storm, a new star spirit power. With Star Storm, you can attack all enemies. Damages them all seven, which is like... Oh, I'll get into that later. Mario, I have a bit, one bit of bad news. Unfortunately, Bowser's life force seems to be getting stronger all the time. Most likely, it's the Star Rod that's giving him more power. We're not even sure if he's noticing it or not, but there's no question that it's making him stronger than before. We will have to be much more careful in the coming trials. Ah, I'm sorry to leave, but I must go back to Starhaven. There's another star spirit waiting for me there. Oh, and if you could, please keep it a secret that I got lost in Forever Forest. Thanks, Mario. Bye. So, Star Storm deals 7 damage to all enemies. 
And at this point in the game, like, pretty much every enemy has 7 HP, so it's basically an insta-kill, and it pierces defense! It's really good. Oh yeah. Alright, well, looks like I'll have to throw away some items. I was going to get an apple beat because I'm full on item. Actually, wait, there's a shop in here. What am I talking about? Ooh, also. Frankie and Boo's Mansion, okay. There aren't that many Boo's just wandering around Boo's Mansion, so this should be easy. Also, this is the music that plays in Boo's Mansion now. Lady Bo is the very definition of grace, beauty, and dignity. No other Boo could fill her shoes as master of the mansion. If she wore shoes, that is. When I behold the lady, my heart goes pit-a-pat. You're Frankie, we are correct. The name's Para Carey. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Never a letter, duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. Oh, thank you. Oh, great, it's finally in. This is from a guy I know who deals in useful items from all over the world. He has a great eye for items. He just got something that I've wanted for a long time. Oh, it's the coolest fiend. Oh, wow, I almost forgot. Could you deliver this for me? Sorry if it's a bother. There's a toad child in Toad Town named Dane T. Please deliver it to him. He always seems to be playing in the station with his pals. He must like trains. Thanks, Abu. What was that supposed to be like a pun of? Thanks a bunch? That's not what it sounded like. Hello! Hey, dude. Welcome to Boo's shop. How can I scare you today? We can check 18 more items. Alright. If you would be a pal... Um, out of these... Store my repel gel, please. And some of these super... Or I guess just one super shroom. I do like this music. Actually, I come to think of it, there's really not any music in this game that I don't like. There we go. That's the apple I wanted. There's a certain recipe that you can only make with an apple. There's only one, though. I feel like there should be more recipes that involve apples. They're such an indispensable ingredient, you know? And I know I could take the pipe back to Tote Town, but it's much more interesting to just walk back what with what's going on in town right now. Beat it, Fuzzy. Oh yeah, I should re uh my badges. need money! Oh wait, I want payoff as well. And you know what? Uh, for the upcoming world, FP Plus probably isn't going to help me a whole lot, so... We'll equip some basic badges, like... Oh, we're going to want Power Smash, I think, and... Uh, power Bounce. Yeah, that looks good. I want money. Music's a bit different, you'll notice. I like this version better. Shy Guys have been raising a ruckus all over town. But compared to ghosts, Shy Guys are nothing. You're Feisty, the guard of... <sighs> I literally only just got the pun there. Feisty. Ugh. I wonder who Bootler is. Uh, oh no! No! This is from that ghost! It says I'll creep up on you while you're sleeping. Boo! He loves scaring me! You think he'll really? Creepy? Darkness? Oh, woe is me! I'll never sleep! Get a hold of yourself, Ice T! Stand tall! Fear not! I'll be okay. Here, take this. I am so sorry, dude. 
That's what happens when you do... Oh, no, 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 no! My favorite frying pan! Hmm. Something screwy going on here. Hey, hey, you little scamp! Get your hands off! Give me back my calculator! Shy guys are trampling all over my flower garden! Oh, the poor flowers! They were so beautiful! It was my dream to fill Toad Town with beautiful flowers. I'm so sad. Take that, Doofus. Take that, Doofus. Oh, thank you! The flowers give you their thanks too, Mario. Man. Shy guys literally are everywhere. Hey, get out of the bed! The Toad House's slogan is, Refresh your body and soul. But... It's impossible to get refreshed with the Shy Guy jumping all over the place. Sorry. Get off the bed! <laughs> now that the Shy Guys are gone, you can stay here. Would you like to take a nap? Nah. Please come again. Stop, thief! A Shy Guy just stole a bag full of undelivered letters. I'm sure there were tons of important letters in that bag. Bills, cards, packages. What are we going to do? Oh, that's right. You can't look at your letters because the Shy Guy just stole them. <laughs> they haven't bothered Merlin. I haven't been reading this, no! Toad Town News. Shy Guy Invasion! Rog being rogues run roughshod! A squad of scurrilous Shy Guys has beset Toad Town, leaving our fair citizens in a daze. The thefts are too numerous to name here, but suffice to say, the residents are urged to guard their possessions. It's still unclear where the Shy Guys are hiding out. We'll post news as it breaks. Righteous Message Board. How many Koopa Troopas have been beaten up by Mario? It's shameful. An anonymous Koopa. Dang, Fane's just got deep. Oh yeah, I totally forgot. That guy had his calculator stolen. We need to talk to him. Oh no, we can't buy any badges from Rolf now. Sorry, bud. I had to close up shop. Some idiot shy guy stole my calculator. Can you believe that? I need that Fane to calculate sales, bud. I'm not a genius. When I find that little punk. I'm a... Dude, come on. I can do calculations in my head, come on. I mean, I'm good at math, but... I mean, come on, you need to know how to do that. You can't rely on electronics for everything. Okay, there's no way the, sh the Shy Guys are in the dojo. No, okay. Why aren't you helping out? <coughs> uh, Mario, welcome. Oh. I was gonna ask him why he's not helping out, since he's the master. Hey, on, I, I gotta see this. This shy guy is just causing trouble in here. He's pretending to shop, but he's not buying anything. Hey, buy something or get out, pal, you hear me? <laughs> Welcome to Shy Guy's shop. Too bad I'm not gonna sell anything to you, Mario. What a butt! <laughs> oh no, poor me. I'm not gonna talk about shy guys. Mario, way to show that little hooligan a thing or two. I love that word. Hooray, thank you so much. I'm still giving great deals at rock bottom prices, so don't be a stranger around here. Ah, words are mocking me. I need that dictionary. Man, the shy guys literally are, like, thieving everything. Curses, Mario. A shy guy stole my dictionary. Please get it back from him. I'm, I'm losing IQ points. Oh boy, they're even here. <laughs> you wouldn't believe it, Shy Guys were everywhere. They move, like the wind, huff huff. All I managed to do is get really upset and yell. That sounds like me playing Lemmings Revolution earlier. <laughs> I did not mean to ditch, ditch you, Luigi. Take off, you lousy Shy Guy! I don't care how convincing your Mario disguise is. You aren't getting in! Stay away from my family! Dad, you are so cool! <laughs> it's little Easter eggs like that that make the Paper Mario series great. Well, one of many, many, many things that make the Paper Mario series great. Take it off. 
<sighs> I'm a great jumper, but my running really needs some work. A little more training and I'll be vital to your team. Alright, take it easy. I know I can't go. You go out on your adventure. I don't even want to anymore. I know that it's up to you to save Princess Peach, so hurry up for my sake. I think my Luigi voice is slowly getting more and more Waluigi-esque as we go on. Wow, 50 star pieces. Whoa, we've almost got half the badges? That's awesome! Only 9 recipes, though. Ooh, Mustafa! Hey, Wanderer, I have heard many stories about your deeds. People speak very well of you. It comforts me to know that Bowser's creatures no longer loot the ancient ruins. Unfortunately, some relics are missing. This is a shame. I've heard that a Koopa was wandering around the ruins. That sounds very suspicious. You should be careful if you meet any suspicious types. Anyway, I must go. I look forward to hearing great tales of your adventures. Mustafa. Or Mousetafa. How are you, dear boy? I've just finished my exhausting research of the ruins found by my unwavering efforts. Sadly, I did not find any treasures as valuable as I had hoped. I will press on, though, old chap. There are treasures hidden all over the world. I hear them calling my famous name, asking me to dig them up. Let's see what Luigi's written in his diary today. There's Luigi's diary! Once again, my brother went on an exciting journey. Once again, he went alone. It's so unfair! I remember the carefree days when we played golf and tennis and had parties. I remodeled the house and made a secret basement. My brother has no idea. I liter Luigi, come on! I literally interrupted you. Maybe he'd already written that. It's the perfect place to write in you, my secret diary. He knows I know where this is. I heard that a ghost appeared in Toad Town today. It was big. Really big. And it had red eyes, a giant gaping mouth, and a mustache. Because they're my secret diary, I'll tell you the truth. Yeah! I hate ghosts! What will I do if it appears at night? Come back, Mario! I'm scared! Yikes! I can feel something behind me! Yeah! I know, I'm sure it's there, but I can't look back. No, no, get away! I think I'll be safe if I don't freeze with fear. I'll just shut my eyes and take five steps back. And then I'll jump and dash into bed. Here I go! Here we go! This too will probably be a longer episode than average, but it's, trust me, Luigi's Diary is always worth a read. It's hilarious. I don't condone reading people's diaries in real life, but in games? Oh heck yeah. Oh heck yeah. I like how this is like a faster paced version of the Toad Town theme. It's great. Speedy spin, I love you. Speedy spin, I do. When we're apart, my heart beats only for you. Ah, my, my. Hello there, Mario. This spot is a little tight for fortune telling. If you want your fortune read, talk to me over the counter. Excuse me? You want my autograph? My, my. Mercy. Are you sure it's mine you want? You really do? Well, this is a first. What shall I do? Ah, of course. I don't mean to be a stick in the mud, but I'll give you the autograph on one condition. A small favor. I want you to visit my twin sister and fetch a crystal ball from her. She lives in a back alley in Dry Dry Outpost. Her name is Merle. Well, Mario, would you? Yeah, sure. These Koopa Koop favors are getting to be harder and harder. I'm the famous Merlot. Rats. Well, at least I had to talk to Merlot lovely. <laughs> well, this next world I've got to say is one of my favorite in video games, like ever. So well done. Like, the, the past three worlds were, like, pretty good. This is where the game just starts rocking your socks in terms of the world design. Uh-oh, she looks sad. Oh, hello there, hon. 
Thank you for coming to visit, but I'm afraid I can't cook now. I'm so sorry. My dear old frying pan was stolen by a shy guy. It really burns me up. I like how nobody even cares that, like, Bo is here. Like, a legit ghost. I can Whoa, I've never checked. Are there shy guys in here? Aw, oh, man. Shy guys didn't find the hidden pipe or something? None in the little oink pit, that's good. Get off the tracks, doofus! <laughs> What do I do? I'm ruined! There's no hope for me! We can't get the train moving because of the pesky shy guy on the tracks! I told him to scram, but he won't listen to me, and he won't move at all! What am I gonna do? Well, so kids, sometimes violence is the only solution! <laughs> That's what Adventure Time taught me! <laughs> oh, thank you, Mario! We're rolling now! All aboard! Are you coming along? No. We hope to see you again! Hey, Dainty. Yippee! See you later, Shy Guy! You're so tough, Mario! I'm gonna get stronger till I can beat up Shy Guys, too! What an aspiration! You're Dainty, correct? The name's Paracarry, and I've got a letter for you. Another letter delivered! Thanks, mister! Wow! I mean, wow! It's an invitation to the Haunted Mansion! When the crypt goes creak and the tombstones quake, spooks come out for a sweet and wake. I didn't think it would really come. All the kids in Toad Town have been talking about this invitation, wondering if it was for real. But now that it's come, I guess I'll have to go. Minnie T, are you brave enough to go with me? Uh, you know I'm really kind of busy and... Oh, yeah, I just had the greatest idea. Let's ask that Yoshi kid from Yoshi's Village to come. You just got a letter from that kid last week, didn't you? You know, the letter we got from the island? Let's send a letter back to him and tell him about the scary adventure we're gonna have. Hey, Mr. Postman, take this letter to the Red Yoshi Kid in Yoshi's Village. Well, yeah, spoiler alert for an upcoming world. But I like to deliver the letters as I go so I don't have to do them all in one episode. That would be kind of boring. No. Must resist the urge to go for the warp pipe. Actually, there's nowhere new I can go with the warp pipe anyways. Mario! Twink, it's been a while. Mario, Mario, good to see you! We found out that you defeated Tubba Bubba. I knew you could do it, I just knew it! When we heard the news, the princess was very relieved. Oh yes, I've got new information about the Honorable Star Spirits who are still imprisoned. Have you ever heard of Shy Guy's Toy Box? It seems that one of the Honorable Star Spirits is being held there. But, where on earth is Shy Guy's Toy Box? I have no idea. Oh, time is short. I have to go back to the princess soon. Good luck, Mario! Princess Peach and I are always cheering you on. What a sweet guy. Hey, you thief! Oh, Mario, it's you. A shy guy stole my storeroom key. I can't stay in business if I can't get into my storeroom. What in the world will I do? Look at all that money we have. Like, I can't remember the last time I had that much money in my pocket in this game. Are Shy Guys just in random houses as well? Nope. I'm glad the Toad Sisters are, uh, doing well. One of set of the Toad Sisters. Are they at the docks? No, we're not talking to him. Hey, the music's still going on here. That's cool. No Shy Guys allowed in Club 64. Alright. It's time to actually go to Shy Guys Toy Box. So, you remember how earlier I said there was a room like this that was just empty? Well, now that we've got Bo... Well, welcome to Shy Guy's Toy Box! Chapter 4, Trials in the Toy Box. Little sneak peek ahead at the boss, and... 
We are in the toy box! Well, that's where we're gonna leave it for today. Thank you for watching. I'm Color Florty. Tune in for the next episode. We're gonna start exploring Shaggy's Toy Box. Have a great day and God bless.